एग्राम स्टूडेंट्स आई वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू वंस अगेन टू द थर्ड पार्ट ऑफ लेसन नंबर सिक्सटीन वॉटर सो लेट्स रिवाइज वंस अगेन वॉट एवर वी हैव लर्न इन द लास्ट सेशन सो इन द लास्ट सेशन वी हैव लर्न अबाउट वॉट इज एग्जैक्टली मीनिंग ऑफ द पल्यूशन ऑफ वॉटर सो वॉट इज द पल्यूशन ऑफ द वॉटर सो एज यू कैन सी दैट इन दिस वॉटर देर आर मेनी टाइप ऑफ द इम्प्यूरिटीज विच आर प्रेजेंट सो फ्यू ऑफ दम इम्प्यूरिटीज आर प्रेजेंट इन द सोल्यूबल फॉर्मेट and few impurities are present in the insoluble format few impurities they are floating on the top of the water and the few impurity they are settled down at the base of the water and such water it is not advisable to drink is that clear so what is basically meaning of the pollution of water student when the other substances get mixed with the water when other substances gets mixed with the water the water becomes impure and some of the substances float in the water so the water becomes unclean and muddy and such water if we drink then we suffer from water borne diseases so if we want to drink water we have to boil it properly and we have to filter that water and then only we should drink such type of the water is that clear student and what we have learnt again we have learned that if large quantities of impurities are mixed with river water the natural process of purification cannot keep the pace and therefore the more the impurities in the water the level of oxygen which is dissolved in water the level of oxygen which is dissolved in water it reduces and therefore when the oxygen level goes down when oxygen level in water goes down it becomes very harmful to the aquatic living organism which are present in the water is that clear student so this is how the water causes a lot of impure water causes a lot of harm to the living organism which are present in the water so therefore student what we have learned the we have learned very simple method of water purification so in this simple method of water purification what we have done we have took the uh, plastic water bottle we have cut into two part and we inverted that plastic water bottle like this and at the mouth of this bottle we have put the cotton cloth and again as you can see that here we can see the three layer at bottom we have poured the powder call above that there is a fine sand and above that there is a coarse sand okay and here you can see that we have poured here the muddy water so the muddy water it will get filtered out and at mouth there are cotton cloth and because of the charcoal the impurities which are present in muddy water they will be absorbed very immediately and again at the base of this bottle a clean water will be accumulated is that clear so this is how the purification of water has been done at our level very easily but the purification of water has been done at the larger scale at water works so like in our area we get a water from tmc and etc so water has to get purified at the higher level so there are basically four step which we usually follow to clean the water at the commercial level so what are the four step for the cleaning of the water so as you can see that over here settling filtration oxygenation and chlorination i repeat once again settling filtration oxygenation and chlorination these are the four processes of water purification which can be done at the water work at the commercial level so now we will learn about all of them one by one okay so now let's see here once again so what is the basic meaning of the settling so in the settling process what exactly it has been done the water from the water source the water from the water source it is allowed to stand in the larger tank so when we allow the water to stand for the longer time then that time what happens students whatever impurities which are present in the water they will get settled down at the bottom am i right and on the top there will be clean water so the settling down is the process where we allow the water to be like that only for longer period and at the bottom there will be more and more impurities okay and most of the time we add alum also 
मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम वी एड एल एम ऑल्सो इन मराठी वी कॉल इट एज तुरटी इन मराठी वी कॉल इट एज तुरटी सो एल एम इज एडेड टू द वॉटर टू प्यूरीफाई सो वेन वी एड द एल एम इन द वॉटर दैट एल एम टेक्स द इम्प्यूरिटी एंड दैट इम्प्यूरिटी विल सेटल डाउन एट द बॉटम ऑफ द वॉटर एंड द रिमेनिंग पोर्शन ऑफ द वॉटर ऑन द अपर सर्फेस इट विल बी क्लीन सो लाइक दिस स्टूडेंट यू एज यू कैन सी दैट ओवर यर हियर इन द वॉटर टैंक द वॉटर इज अलाउड टू सेटल डाउन and the water which we can see here on the upper surface it is safe and it is drinkable so this type of the process we call it as what settling so by this process also the water can be purified very easily now the second step is the filtration so what do you exactly mean by the filtration the water is filtered using filtered machine the water is filtered using the filtered machine so as you can see that over here here in this diagram so as you can see that there are many filter machines are joined here there are machines which are joined here and there is a water so the water which is present here it is filtered by the filtered machine so like at our home aqua filter guard etc are present which is a smaller machine right but at the commercial level this machines are very big at the larger scale at the larger scale the water has been purified okay so i hope so students now you must have understood about what do you mean by the filtration now the third step which we are going to learn that is the oxygenation so in oxygenation what we do air and water are allowed to mix up with the pump air and water are allowed to mix with the help of the pump by using pump we add air and we add the oxygen purposefully this causes oxygen from the air to dissolve in the water what i had told you in case of the impurity the oxygen which is dissolved in water that goes down and that causes harm effect to the living thing so what we are doing here we are providing oxygen artificially artificially we are allowing oxygen to go inside the water so that the level of oxygen in the water will increase so when the level of oxygen in the water it will increase the water will get purified very immediately and there will be no harm effect to the animals or plants which are present in the water so as you can see that student over here there are pipes are present there are machines are present so by using this pipes and by using this machines and there are certain pumps as well so here pumps are also there so by using the pump we are allowing oxygen and air to go inside the water to increase the amount of oxygen which is present in water okay so i hope so now you must have understood about oxygenation fourth step which we are going to learn that is chlorination so in chlorination what we exactly do we add chlorine chlorine is a type of the chemical chlorine is a type of the chemical when chlorine is added to the water it kills the germs which are present in the water students you must have visited the water park so the uh, smell of the water which is present in the water park it is something different so the water which is present in the water park that is because of the chlorine so the chlorine has that particular type of the smell so the because of the chlorine the smell of the water park that is something different okay so what is the role of the chlorine the chlorine kills the germs which are present in the water and therefore the water becomes purified and the water pollution will be avoided so as you can see that here in this diagram also student so here you can see that there are pump here in the chlorine gas is present in this chlorine gas is present sometime chlorine is available in powder format also the chlorine has been dissolved in water okay so i hope so student now you must have understood about what is filtration what is oxygenation what is settling down and what is chlorination as well so let's recall once again what is meaning of that so we have learned that water purification has been completed at four step first one settling then filtration then oxygenation and then chlorination what is settling i told you that in settling process the water from water source is allowed to stand in the large tank and sometime in settling process lm is also used and in filtration process water is filtered using the filtered machine and third one in chlorine in oxygenation what we do we provide air and water to mix with the pump and therefore the oxygen level in water get increases and water will get purified very immediately and in the fourth step 
we add chlorine in the water so that the germs which are present in that it will be killed very immediately is that clear so i hope so student the four type of the water purification you must have understood in detail so the next part of this topic we will continue in the next session bye bye take care